from behind the razor wire of Christmas Island, a plea from a family still in limbo. Try to say positive and hope that the minister will let us go back to below. Priya Nardes and their two Australian-born daughters have spent almost three years in immigration detention after they were taken from their Biloela home in 2018. The family's claims for protection visas were denied a year earlier, launching a three-year legal battle. I want my daughters to grow up with freedom and peace. The federal court last year ruled the youngest daughter, Tanika, had not been afforded procedural fairness in her protection visa application. The federal government appealed, but today the full bench of the federal court dismissed that appeal. In some ways, we're in the hands of the minister as to what happens next. But the court also dismissed the family's appeal relating to how Tarnika's visa application should be assessed. It means that the application that was before the minister needs to be considered appropriately and procedural fairness offered to it. The ruling essentially means the family stays in limbo. Their lawyers and supporters are pleading with authorities to release them from detention while all legal avenues are pursued, a process that could take years. Biloela is not giving up, calling for compassion from Canberra. This family should be given special consideration by the minister, which he has the power to do, to come home and live their lives in Biloela. The Department of Home Affairs says it's considering the decision but maintains multiple courts have found the family is not owed protection and reiterates government policy, anyone attempting illegal maritime travel won't be settled here. Rachel McGee, ABC News.